So we're throwing 12 times and we want to make at least 11 throws. So that means we want to make either 11 or 12 free throws. So we're going to find the probability of 11 and find the probability of 12 and add them up. So the probability of making 11 three free throws is that I have, I'm making 12 shots, I want to choose 11 out of them that I'm going to make. The probability of getting it, of making it is a half. I want that to happen 11 times. The probability of not making it also happens to be a half. Those have to add up to one. Uh, and I need that to happen once because I'm throwing 12 times. So if you do that, this is 12, so it's 12 out of 4, 0, 9, 6. So 2 to the 11th time, 2 to the 1st gives you that. We do it again. Uh, so the probability of making exactly 12, uh, there are 12 throws. I want to choose all 12 of them to make. Uh, there's a half a chance of making a shot. I want to make all 12 of them. Half a chance of not. I want none of those. So basically, this is just a half to the 12th which is just 1 over 4, 0, 9, 6. And again, this is your binomial probability. There's a formula for it, but I don't like it. You just kind of reason it out. It works. So there's, uh, if I add these probabilities, there's a 13 out of 4, 0, 9, 6 chance of making my shots. And that's actually what I want this time. I'm not doing anything finding what I don't want. That's what I want, 11 or 12, and you find yourself saying or, you tend to add, there you go, phew.